Good day, good day, royal fans. Today's headline. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle haven't become part of the community in their US neighborhood, it has been claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are reportedly rarely seen in public in Montecito, where they share a lavish 11 million pound mansion and live among some of Hollywood's biggest names. Described as the Cotswolds of California, the secluded town in Santa Barbara boasts pristine beaches and gated compounds, with locals, famous or not, known for having a zero-tolerance policy for paparazzi. Harry, who has been in Holland with his wife for the Invictus Games, told NBC show last week they have been welcomed with open arms in Montecito, adding it was such a great community. But it appears this sort of statement may baffle some of the neighbours. Richard Minyards, who writes for the Montecito Journal, said the Sussexes have been a no-show since covertly arriving in July 2020, months after stepping down as working royals in the UK. He told the Times, Harry and Meghan haven't become part of the community, and I think a lot of people are bristling about that really. It's such a lovely place to go out, and they've been a no-show. There is this big question of, where are they? The Duke is yet to even visit Old King's Road, a British-influenced bar on Santa Barbara's main drag. That being said, he may soon become a little more visible, having joined the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club, according to reports. It's thought he'll play with Paul Ignacio Nacho Figuerera, the Argentinian multi-millionaire polo professional and Rolf Lauren model, when the season begins on May 1st. Fellow Etunian Andrew Bossom, who is also a keen polo fan, told the Times such a move would be a huge step into the local community for him. Harry is said to have been practicing on a private polo field owned by hotel magnate Pat Nesbitt. Many locals are understood to have heard rumours, however, he is keen to sell up and buy somewhere else nearby. A similar rumour claims Harry and Meghan had recently tried and eventually given up trying to get burgers from fast food restaurants in and out due to security logistics. <laughs> Tough times, huh? Alright guys, that's it for today. You know the drill. Please do like, comment and subscribe. And until tomorrow, goodbye for now.